Hi everyone, Gnev here. I wanted to make this short video to help you with installing AutoHotKey. So after you downloaded it from the website, you just run it. And uh, when you come here, you should be able to make a new script. So when you go to new, you should have this option available if you installed it. You click auto hotkey script, you name it however you like. I'm gonna name it script one. And then you go to edit script. You delete what's in it. And then you just go to, to the string. Gergin wrote this one in the comments and I think it's really, really good. You copy it over to your string and you save it. All right, so now we have it on, on the screen, right? So we double click it to activate it. You should see it here when, it, when it's activated. And we also need to press scroll lock for it to, to work. So after you press it, you can test it out in a notepad document. You can see here that every button I bound there work, works as promised, right? <laughs> so also if you wanna add something to it, I'm gonna stop it here. If you wanna add something to the script, you just go edit. And let's say I wanna add uh, T. Let's say a big bind for me is T. You just change the R. You copy, you copy the string and you just change it to whatever number you, you want or whatever letter you want. And you just save it. We click it again to activate it. Uh, we see it working here. We press scroll lock, go to the document. And T is working like that, uh, like I promised in the video, right? Uh, let's try a number that's not bound, like G. You see how, how long it takes it to, to start working. And how all the numbers and letters I bound work really quick. Anyway, I hope this helps you. Uh, <laughs> you, you just try it in WoW, it's gonna work wonders for you. And uh, yeah, have a good one.